Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to From the Holler. My name is Missy, and I am so glad that you decided to pop in and join us this morning. If you are new, welcome, welcome, welcome. Please remember to hit that subscribe button. Aiden and I would be greatly appreciative of that. So this morning, we're back in the kitchen, and we're going to make sweet potato pie. Y'all, I bought sweet potatoes to can them and the longer I looked at them sitting in my pantry the more I wanted a sweet potato pie so I am going to snatch about three of these potatoes and we're going to make just that <laughs> so let's go get this pie made the first thing we're going to do is we're going to get our water heating up on the eye I've got it on high we want to bring it to a boil I've got three, whoop, my eggs are rolling over here. I've got my eggs out over there to come to room temperature, but I've got three medium-ish size sweet potatoes. You need about a pound. And I am just going to take a fork and I am just poking a few holes in my sweet potatoes. We're going to boil these. You can totally roast these in the oven if you prefer that. I've washed my sweet potatoes, so they're good to go. I'll go ahead and put that one in. You can roast these. You can do however you want to do them, but you just want these to get soft and mashable, okay? Workable. And you want to make sure that you, however you do it, you can get these peels off. So we're going to boil these and it'll take about 50 minutes to an hour to get these good and soft. There we go. All right, there's step one finished and now all we have to do is wait on it to boil and those to get tender. Our potatoes are fork tender and the skin is starting to separate already so we are going to turn our stove eye off. I have a bowl of ice water over here. You can run this under the cold water in the sink if you'd like. Oop, I'm going to have to get some towels because they are falling apart. I got busy doing some other stuff. And that one does not want to fit, so I'm going to break it like that. Okay, yay. So we're going to move this back so y'all can see. I'm going to let this sit here for just a second, because I do want it to cool off a little bit to where I can stand to touch it. It's still hot. I've got a little plate over here that I'm going to put the skins on. Y'all, that skin just falls right off. It's a lovely thing. It's a beautiful thing. It really is. <laughs> so you just want to get as much of the skin off as possible. And if you want to take a little paring knife and run it across through here, you can. I'm just using my fingers. Ow. Super hot. Super hot. Alright, so there's all the skin off of that one. So we're just going to put that over here in our mixing bowl. I love it when a plan comes together like this. When things are so easy. And it took mine about 45 minutes to get fork tender. To get to this point. And I love that. Mine, that's why I use these kind of smaller ones. Mine were on the smallish side. And that's one reason I love it. Put it back down in there. Okay. 
I love sweet potato pie. I love it. I love pumpkin pie. And I look forward to making that. We went to the Mennonite store yesterday and they had a whole basket of these sitting there for five dollars. And I've got some out there in the garden. They're not ready yet. And I thought, you know what? I'm gonna spend five dollars and get me some of those. There's different things I want to make. I want to make some sweet potato butter. And I want to just have some sweet potatoes canned up, sitting on the shelf, so that I can do this anytime I want to. I can make me a pie. I have one child that loves, that shares my love of pumpkin and sweet potatoes. And I'm sure if he's watching this, he is getting excited. He thinks he's going to get a piece, I'm sure. <laughs> now. <laughs> Uh, I love them. I love sweet potatoes. I love to throw them in the oven and roast them with some butter and brown sugar, cinnamon, and that's it, y'all. There is our sweet potatoes all peeled up, and they're ready to start making the pie. We've got our sweet potatoes. I'm going to take my fork and just kind of mash them up a little bit. And break that up just a little bit. Now I'm going to take a stick of unsalted butter. I've, this is the one I leave out on the counter to soften. I'm going to add the whole stick. You need a quarter cup of butter. going to add that to our potatoes. Now we're going to take our electric mixer and we're going to beat our butter and our potatoes together for just a second. Then we're going to add one cup of white sugar, which I thought I, oh, I do. I've got my Splenda. We're going to be using Splenda in this one to make it a little more sugar friendly. So, one cup. Splenda is a one to one ratio. And if you've not watched any of my other baking videos with the Splenda, uh, it can change the baking time. So you'll have to watch that. I've got two eggs, two large eggs, and we're just going to add those in. And I have got a half a cup of milk. I'm using whole milk. You can use whatever you choose. We like whole milk. I am using a half teaspoon of cinnamon. Heavy on that. Just a little more. What's a little more cinnamon? I'm using a half teaspoon of nutmeg. 
I love nutmeg too. It just smells so warm. And a teaspoon of vanilla. And I'm just eyeballing that. And then we're going to take our mixer, mix this all together. I want to get my oven preheated to 
and the oven is getting preheated to 350. Let me grab out a baking sheet. And we are just going to set this on here. Like that right there. Y'all look how beautiful that pie is. Oh, mercy. Oh, mercy. That's going to be so good. I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. All right. This is going into the oven at 350 for about 55 to 60 minutes or until a toothpick or a butter knife put in the middle comes out clean. Y'all, I can't wait. So let's get this thing in the oven. I know my oven is not completely preheated, but I can't wait any longer. And I'm going to be very careful about moving this around because it is so full. All right, there we go. It's in the oven. And in about an hour, we'll have a, ourselves a sweet potato pie. Y'all, I am going to put a piece of foil over top of my pie because I don't want the crust to burn. Because this is a long baking pie. Now I'm just going to kind of tin it just a little bit. Just press those edges down a little bit. Nothing major. Nothing at all. That's it. That's what I had to do. We've got about 30 more minutes cooking time. Ish. Heavy on the ish. And then we'll have ourselves a sweet tater pie. We're going to check on our pie. See where we're at with it. Oh my goodness. I am going to bring it out of the oven for this. Whoop. Let's see. Oh no. So am I. And I can already tell that the middle is not quite set. Okay. You can see it's a different color. Yeah. It's not done yet. But I wanted to make sure. I'm going to leave the aluminum foil off of it for the rest of the time because my crust is looking really good. It's not burning. It's not cooking too fast. So this is going to go back in the oven. And I am going to check it about every 10 minutes or so. So we don't overcook it. You don't want to overcook your sweet potato pie. I've got a little bit right here on this knife. Hmm, lower. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Gotta have some more. Hmm, yeah. I'll put my food in this pie. Yum. Alright, y'all. We'll check this in about 10 minutes and see where we're at. We're going to check our pie. I think it might be done. So we're going to see. Oh my goodness. It looks, yeah, it's set. It is set. Look at there. Look at there. Oh yeah. It's going to finish baking like that right there. We're going to turn the oven off, turn the timer off. We are good. Look at that beautiful pie, y'all. Look, look, look at that beautiful pie. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. I can't wait. We're gonna let it sit right here for just a few minutes. Then I'm gonna grab a cooling rack and we're gonna say it on it for it to finish cooling. But y'all, look at that. Oh. I'm ready for fall, y'all. <laughs> I am. I'm ready for fall. It's time to taste test this pie. Look, y'all. Oh, my goodness. It just, mm. if y'all only knew, we are going to, we take it off of the baking or the cooling sheet, cooling rack, whatever. 
I'm just going to use my fancy little serving spatula here. And we are going to get this out like that. Oh, man. Here we go, y'all. Here we go. Look at that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let me turn y'all up here where you can see. Hey. All right. Here we go. Oh, you crooked. Here we go. Mm. Yeah. That's good. We've been joined, as you can see, and somebody wants to try a taste test. Ready? Mmm. What do you think? It's good. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What, what kind of pie is this? Sweet potato. Sweet potato pie. Mm-hmm. No wonder it's so good. Now this is delicious. I love potatoes. Delicious. I love and I, it, potatoes. it makes me want to make file hurry up and get here a little quicker. <laughs> but yeah. Mm. We'll be doing this again. So. This stuff is mine. Thank y'all for being here. Thank y'all for watching. Thank y'all for supporting our little channel. Don't forget to hit that like and like. Mm-hmm. Like Don't and forget, subscribe button? Yeah. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you like seeing our content, our our life, what goes on here. You never know. And always remember, Jesus loves you. Thank you. Yeah, I'm going to go finish my piece of pie. Apparently, somebody just likes the sweet potato portion of it and not the crust. I wonder who that could be. <laughs> I'm going to go finish my pie, y'all. Y'all be blessed, and we'll see you all tomorrow. Bye, y'all.